for this mandala I start with a magic ring and six chain one two three four five and six four chain count as first triple crochet and two chain space we have to make 12 triple crochet into magic ring two chain another triple crochet and two chain another triple crochet and two chain I come back here last triple crochet and two chain a slip a stitch into very first triple crochet four chain one two three four so one two three four into four we make a slip stitch and round one finish close the magic ring round two three chain a front post triple crochet around first triple crochet a front post triple crochet Three double crochet into two chain space. A front post triple crochet in around next triple crochet. Three double crochet into two chain space we continue this pattern until we finish this round and I come back here for close round two make a slip stitch into very first triple crochet top of this I make a, a slip stitch round two you have to count your stitches 12 triple crochet and 36 double crochet round three we want to make only single crochet top of every stitch a chain a single crochet top of triple crochet a single crochet top of next a single crochet top of next you have to make 48 single crochet and I come back here for close round 3 make a slip stitch into very first single crochet round 4 we want to work top of this triple crochet so 3 chain another double crochet same here first three chain count as first double crochet so two double crochet two chain two more double crochet in the same place one and two We don't crochet three single crochet in the four top of this triple crochet we make a two double crochet two chain and two double crochet
again two double crochet top of this triple crochet into single crochet one two two chain two double crochet We continue this pattern and we make 12 of these leaves and I come back here. For close round 4 we make a slip stitch into very first double crochet. Top of this 3 chain we make a slip stitch. Now round 5. For round five, we have to move into two chain space. So I make another slip stitch and I move into chain space, chain one, a single crochet into chain space, five chain, A single crochet into next two chain space, five chain, a single crochet into next one chain space, and we continue this pattern until we finish this round and I come back here. For close round five, make a slip stitch into very first single crochet. Round six, three chain, count as first double crochet, seven double crochet into five chain space, one, two, three, four, five, Six and seven. A double crochet top of this single crochet. Seven double crochet into five chain space. and seven a double crochet top of single crochet we continue this pattern until we finish this round and I come back here round six you have to count your double crochet and 96 double crochet for close this round make a slip stitch top of first double crochet top of three chain one, two, three. Round six is finished right now. Round seven, three chain, a triple front post, front post triple crochet around the first double crochet. back post double crochet around next double crochet back post double crochet around next and another double crochet around next three back post double crochet now a triple front post triple crochet around this four middle of this seven around four we make a triple front post front post triple crochet now three back post double crochet one two and three
triple front post around this one top of this single crochet so this round we make a triple three back post front post triple three double crochet back post and repeat this pattern now three back post double crochet front post triple crochet three back post double crochet a triple front post and continue this pattern until we finish this round and I come back here for close round seven we make a slip stitch top of first triple crochet and round seven is finished round eight a chain we want to make single crochet all around this project back post single crochet Back for single crochet around this triple even totally 72 back post single crochet and we come back here for close round eight we make a slip stitch into very first back post single crochet round eight is finished round nine we want to work top of this triple crochet into this back post single crochet top of this triple crochet okay three chain count as first double crochet we want to make three double crochet cluster so we make two more double crochet here one and two three loops on the hook and a cluster three chain another three double crochet cluster in the same place one double crochet two three and a cluster three chain another cluster in the same place one two three and a cluster chain one a single crochet top of this triple crochet into back post single crochet of round eight one chain we want to make these pedals top of next triple crochet into this single crochet so three double crochet cluster three chain another cluster in the same place one two three three chain another cluster here one two and three four loops on the hook 
one chain a single crochet top of next triple crochet into this back for single crochet a chain and continue this pattern until we finish this round and I come back here for close round nine we make a slip stitch top of this cluster first cluster now round 10 for round 10 we move into three chain space with a slip stitch three chain count as first double crochet and five more double crochet into same three chain space one two three four five and totally six double crochet here another six double crochet into next three chain space one two three four five and six a double crochet into one chain space a single crochet top of single crochet a double crochet into one chain space six double crochet into next three chain another six double crochet then one double crochet a single crochet one double crochet and we continue this pattern until we finish this round and I come back here after the last six double crochet a double crochet into one chain space A single crochet top of single crochet a double crochet into one chain space for close round 10 we make a slip stitch into very first double crochet top of very first double crochet the slip stitch round 10 is finished round 11 3 chain we want to make back post double crochet around this double crochet back post double crochet we make six back post double crochet two three four five and six three chain another six back post double crochet another six back post double crochet one two three four five and six now we are here do double crochet front post cluster 
one and two three loops on the hook and it's like this now back postal crochet we make six back post double crochet two three four five and six three chain six more back post double crochet three four five and six now we are here we make two front post double crochet cluster one and around next double crochet two three loops on the hook and the cluster we don't crochet into single crochet we repeat this pattern and i will back here for close round 11 we make a slip stitch top of first double crochet And round 11 is finished round 12 chain 1 we want to make single crochet top of every double crochet 1 2 3 4 five and six into three chain space we make two single crochet three chain two single crochet into three chain now a single crochet top of every double crochet top of this cluster we make a front post single crochet again six single crochet two single crochet into three chain space three chain two single crochet into three chain space six single crochet and a front post single crochet top of this cluster and we continue this pattern until we finish this round and i come back here 12 after the last front post single crochet i make a slip stitch into very first single crochet and another chain and pull the yarn and cut this yarn like this now this mandala is finished if you want to make a dream catcher you need a bigger loop it's about five centimeter 
bigger than almond as well. For a start, for a start to make a dream catcher, we need to do like this in two three chain space. Not after you finish like this, you have to crochet single crochet all around this loop so I just start with a slip knot and fix them all the right position I want to start from here make a slip knot Start single crochet around the slope, chain one, and a single crochet, and continue this single crochet until we finish around the slope. finish all single crochet around this ring it looks like this now this is our mandala I hope you enjoyed this video if you like it please give it a like and subscribe and thanks for watching when you arrive top of this three chain space you have to make a single crochet into this chain space too like this i make a single crochet into this for more safety And continue this single crochet until we finish this round and I come back to show you how it look like now this is our mandala I hope you enjoyed this video if you like it please give it a like and subscribe and thanks for watching